Hello and welcome to News Mobile Prime Time Wrap. I am Saurabh Shukla. Here are the top news stories of the day. A major debate on Prime Minister Narendra Modi's remarks that Congress wants to snatch Women's Mangal Sutra. The Prime Minister reiterated on Tuesday that he had put the truth before the country that Congress is hatching a deep conspiracy to snatch your property and distribute it to its special people. Addressing a public meeting in Rajasthan's Tonk today, PM Modi said that his speech had created panic in the entire Congress and India bloc. Further sharpening his attacks, PM Modi said that the thinking of Congress has always been of appeasement and vote bank politics. Delhi Chief Mr. Arvind Kejriwal and Telangana lawmaker K. Kavitha, both arrested last month in connection with an alleged legal policy scam, have been remanded to extended judicial custody for 14 days. The opposition politicians, held week before the Lok Sabha election, will remain in Delhi's Tehar jail until their next court appearance scheduled for May 7th. Kejriwal has a pending plea in the Supreme Court challenging his arrest by the Enforcement Directorate on March 21st over money laundering charges. The court heard the matter on April 15th but deferred immediate relief awaiting a response from the federal agency. The plea is set for further consideration on April 29th, just three days after the second phase of the election. Two helicopters collided mid-air on Tuesday during a rehearsal of Royal Malaysian Navy Parade in Lumet, killing 10 people. A video of collision shows that two helicopters were flying when front end of one of them collided with the rear rotor of the other leading to the fall of both the helicopters. In a statement, the Royal Malaysian Navy, also known as TDLM, said the Marine Operation Helicopter from RMN FNNEC fleet crashed at RMN's Lumut base at 9.32 am. Subhash Ghai's announcement of completion of the script for Khalayak 2 has set fans abuzz with excitement. The renowned director, known for the iconic Khalayak featuring Sanjay Dutt, is now in search of the ideal actor to portray Balu Balram. Ranbir Singh, Ranbir Kapoor, Alu Arjun and Yash are among the contenders vying for the lead role, fueling anticipation among fans. In an exclusive report by India Today, a source close to Ghai disclosed that the script for Khalayak 2 is already finalized. While Sanjay Dutt's involvement in the sequel remains uncertain, Ghai is actively scouting for the perfect fit to embody the iconic character Balu Balram. Notably, Ghai's casting aspirations extended beyond Bollywood with names like Ranveer Singh, Ranbir Kapoor, Alu Arjun and Yash being considered. Who do you think will be fit for the role? Comment down below. In the midst of 2024 Lok Sabha polls, a 42-second video is doing rounds on social media in which actor Ranveer Singh can be seen endorsing the Congress party and mocking Prime Minister Narendra Modi. News Mobile fact-checked the video and found it to be a deep fake. With a keyword search for Ranveer Singh endorsed Congress, the News Mobile fact-checked team was unable to find any credible news report corroborating such incident which raised doubts. Further scrutiny revealed unnatural lift movements by Ranveer in the viral video, along with audio that lacked a natural flow of speech, prompting suspicion of digital manipulation. Running the video keyframes through reverse image search, the News Mobile fact check team traced a YouTube video uploaded by Newswire ANI dated April 14, 2024, with the headline, and I quote, Ranveer Singh Kirti Sanan visit Kashi Vishwanath Temple, loud PMs, Vikas B. Virasad B. Vision. After closely analyzing the original video, Newsmall's fact check team discovered that the video in question was manipulated using deep fake technology. Keep following Newsmall for more such fact checks and beyond. Thanks for watching News Mobile Primetime Wrap and do let us know what do you think of our stories and do share this video. Thanks for watching.